This video will show you all the software tools required to do local IntelliJ IDEA GUI script development and unit test. These are the four things that you should download. Let's go through one by one. First, we should download the JDK 8 because CPI is running using JDK 8, so we download the same version. For me, um, I will download for the Windows version. You need to have your Oracle login. I already registered and just download it. Then we go to the second one, CPI library. These are the dependency CPI jar library that is required. Under using script API, not this, not the adapter one, but under here, download this tool. Okay. Now next go to the third one, Groovy library. For the Google library, first you, you should not download this version number 3, although it's very big, obvious here. Instead, you should download either version 2.4 or 2.5. Up to now, currently on December 2021, from what I'm aware is, CPI is using version 2.4. But for me, and so far, all the while, for the past few years, at least one or two years, I've been using the Groovy version 2.5, and it's working fine. For me, I prefer to using 2.5, so that, so that if I'm, the 2.5 is working fine, if in future, CPI upgrade to the later version 2.5, and I have the confidence that it's been working fine in the past for me using 2.5. So I chose 2.5. Okay, download. Then go to the last one. This is a IntelliJ IDEA IDE. For this one, it's for the Groovy script development. You don't need to download for the ultimate. The, the free community version is sufficient. Okay. So now let's go to the download library. And I quickly install it one by one.
Okay. Next is the CPI library. CPI library you cannot install. Instead, I need to move it to a separate folder that I can add to IntelliJ IDE later. So I create a LIB stand for library folder and another subfolder called CPI to put all the CPI related library here and we are good for now then the groovy library for this one I will do the same go to C drive library and move the groovy library here and the last one IntelliJ Okay, then run it. Yep, I will stop here. Next video, I'm going to talk about uh, do all the setup, configure. IntelliJ for Groovy development. See you in next video.